Supply depots down the line, Scott to the Antarctic. The supply depots for more posts. Anyone else understand that? Nope. Great. I think he's just found out it's on. I'll turn it off. Oops. If you do it with your back and finger, you get more shots through one little bit. <laughs> what a stupid game to put on. <laughs> In case, choke. <laughs> Just come on, yeah. Just check the fuel. My own little dipstick. We have fuel. Winning. Good morning everyone, if you have not already don't forget to hit the subscribe button, ring the little bell, videos every Tuesday and Friday and the odd occasion we do the Sunday video, which I haven't done the past two days, weeks, I do apologise, we're mad busy, um, trying to get stuff done, what it's like. Okay, so today is a very exciting day, because I'm a loser I get excited about stuff like this, people ask, are you kind of a tractor guy or a cow guy, and I'm like, well I don't mind tractor work, I don't mind cow work, but then when I get excited about, we are, what we're doing today is, we are putting electric fence out so cows can start grazing some more grass and uh, we strip graze with electric fence. I'm excited because the cows are going to come to fresh grass because I know that they'll like it, if that makes sense. But I quite like that, that we get, you get those cows of fresh grass, they'll love it. You can see when we were coming in on the gate that, that they know, they know something's up, they know something different happening so they're following and they know they've got to get something different. The old cows are probably telling the younger ones like, this is going to be a good day today. That's what we're going to do today. We put the electric fence all the way down and we strip graze it. And what we're going to do is we're going to change the way we're going to do it this year. But I'll explain that later on. I'm on a new mic today, which is very, very exciting. I got this mic bought from me by one of you guys sent it me. Thank you very much. You know who you are. I don't know if you want to shout out or not. Um, maybe next video. I need to ask you really. I really do appreciate it. So we're on a new mic. Same GoPro. Let's see if this works. Fingers crossed. Touch wood. All that good stuff. Hopefully it does. Right. So how we're going to do this to start with. Kawasaki started. Thank God. It's amazing. What we're going to do is we have the corner post, which is here. Uh, Dad has the reel, don't you, Father? Have the reel. We'll take the reel. it up, run it out this way from the Kawasaki. We'll put the post in every 10 or 12 strides. We just need some more farmer's friend string to tie that gate. We haven't okay. got any. Find something. Well, when we come Find back, when I get cows in, because we'll all be yeah. in by the end yeah. of the day anyway. Yeah. I'll come back when I do it later, when I get my cows in. Um, so what Dad was saying then is, so we've got the wire, the line, from the wire here. Another bigger swing on it, you might need that for your side there. So you'll see that it's got a rubber pipe on the end just to give it some insulation so it doesn't short out, is that right? That's right. That's so it doesn't right. short out, not on earth, it's insulated, so it doesn't short out on the um, post that he's going to put it on. to put it down there, he's going to reel it all the way out and then we'll put the tripod at this end with the battery power. You see I've got a spare battery, hopefully this works. There are some solar power systems you can use. It's like a little solar system and it charges the battery as you go, which would be perfect. But I don't have that, so if someone wants to send it to me, amazing. But I don't have that right now. So and we just use batteries and they last about eight weeks. So they do all right. Oh, the last season as long as they don't short out. Uh, I bet you that doesn't last a season. It will do. No, I bet you a new battery doesn't last a season. If we got a new battery today. Yeah. This could be a good debate because like in it will last eight weeks when it dies, ten weeks, um, we'll go, you were wrong. As long as it doesn't short out, it will last the season, as long I as it's it looked after. This is very exciting. Again, I'm a loser. I get excited because the cows are going to be happy. Is that a weird thing to be excited? Because look, look, they're happy. They're ready for it. They're like, something is going on. Right, okay, so you're going to run up there. Yeah. I'll do the corner post. You'll and set up and get ready. Set up, get some posts. Where are you going from? Oh, you want to set your corner post up to be safe. You're going to set up this side of the gate. Yeah, yeah, I was going to do this side of the gate. Yeah, just because that gate doesn't have... 
a string on it. So you see that dip? Yeah. You're going to go right side of the dip, yeah? Just this side of the dip and this side of the gate. Just in case they break through. Just in case they break through, hopefully. But yeah. So that's what we're going to do. Away. Sayonara. See you later. Right, let's get set up. How straight is his line? It's pretty straight, I'll give him that. And then we have corkscrew that goes in the end. So you corkscrew that down, and then what your reel will go onto here, and then it goes on a tripod like so. Um, corkscrew so it doesn't move. These cows are big animals, and I know it's electrified and stuff. Ooh. Electrified, is that a word? Is that a word? I just made a word up. Who knows? Uh, so it works like that tripod to that so they can't get past, and then goes down. The line and then all we do is put the rods in and jobs a good in you'll see that what dad did is when he stops like every say 60 yards put a lot of fence posts there stop 60 yards saves carrying 500 of these things because that's an awful that's a handful of nine but you carry try and carry 36 four times as much it's hard work and not only that it's like putting um supply depots down the line scott to the antarctic the supply depots for more folks anyone else understand that no nope. great father is starting that side i'm gonna start the top side because i am youthful and i have newer knees compared to him what i'm gonna have to do is put you guys down i know we're gonna have to be away from each other for a little bit because i need two hands and stupidly i didn't bring my Chest cam. So how we do it is tuck it under, pigtail, like that. Easy. Next. It's like Goliath and the stone or the sword. Look at that. Look at that. Nice. You're on the piss a bit. I think you need to reline yours actually. Mine, a bob on there. Look, the line. So Dad's done his this side. He's done his on a bit on the, bit on, bit on the piss. Had a few beers. Well, I want to show you what he does at the end. <laughs> oh, classic father, if I've never seen it myself. I couldn't find a fence post, so use your old branch. There it is. So that goes around there. Insulates it. Shouldn't short it out. Amazing. Just say mine straight. He's moving mine now. Just putting some curve on it. I was right. He was wrong. Just say loads of grass. Right. I've got to turn it on. Yeah, so what I was trying to explain before, if I didn't explain it well, like so, so people ask me if I'm a tractor guy or a cow guy. I like my tractor work, but I do get it does get a bit repetitive after a while. Like mowing, you can see the field getting done. Paraharing, that was a good job. They were dead. That's probably not come out yet. But like cows, you wouldn't have the tractors without the cows, but you can have the cows without the tractors because you do it manual labour. But you wouldn't be slurry carting, you wouldn't be mowing for grass, you know. So to me, they're a more important thing on the farm to look after. And uh, that's why I probably prefer cows because they are good to me. So I like to be good to them, the way it works. That definitely was not straight. Thank you. So next job is battery power pack that only lasts eight weeks. Take that off there. That bottom one's on the earth. Green one goes on the earth on the bottom. And then there to there. On. Like that. I'd laugh if it is on. Turn it on. You're on! I think he's just found out it's on. I'll turn it off. Oops. Can it turn on then? Yeah. I forgot that you were still uh, moving it about. So it works at least. It's on. It's on. Oh no, it turned it off because you kept moving stuff. Jobs are good and pretty much. Yeah, you just said it works. Oh, no, no, no. oh. Right, turn on. Stop. Here's a piece of grass. Why did you 
easiest piece of gas. Start up. It's not working. Let's get a battery. No way of checking these batteries though, is there? Yep. Which is not. Give that a go. Give that a go. Annoying. Both batteries had died, uh, so Dad's trying to look for a new one, and I think he's found one because it's only been two seconds. It's amazing. This could work. I would like one of them solar panel ones. I think they're great. I think the idea is really good. So when it's not sunny, sorry, it's been charged from the solar power, um, but when it is sunny, it uses the sun power. It's a great idea. You find one. This, this is it guys, so we've got this one here and then we've got the new one that will last all season. Yeah, well, try that first. do is get a piece of grass. Ah, works. <laughs> you actually not got your wellies on, so you're earthing yourself better. Oh, yeah. Stand with your wellies on. You won't. Oh, yeah, look at that. There you are. Something simple. Put on your knees. It's a bigger hit. We'll put it on a high power for now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Grab hold of the post. No. Do it that way. That no. hurts. That's why I know it won't. It tittles. But the more you grab hold of it like that, you grab hold of it fully with your hand. I don't want it. No. Why, why it won't hurt. It won't hurt. Go on, fully. Why? Quickly. Right, right. Go on, quickly. Go on. Grab hold of it. Fully tight. Doesn't hurt. Yeah. You do it with your back and finger, you get more shots through one little bit. <laughs> what a stupid game to put. Well, <laughs> there you right. go, now just turn to my finger, just one finger, one finger, not the bigger <laughs> shot. But you got three fingers, there's less shots. Well, right guys, so we're done. The cable's up, put the cable out, we put the posts in, we put four new batteries. That is a brand new battery which is gonna last the whole, the whole season. season. If it doesn't get knocked out on earth. If it doesn't can people put a forfeit in the comment section below that's pretty cool if it doesn't last dad's forfeit if it does last i have a forfeit in october time because that's the end of the season i would say if it doesn't get shorted out it'll last all season. there we go guys let's let these cows go because time's money as dad keeps saying So guys, that is the end of the video. The cows are in the new little patch of grass. So what we're, where we've put them is, so when they come out of the parlor, that first field they went in when they got kicked out, and now they're in just a little bit of area, the field passed it. What we'll do every couple of days, we'll move the electric fence back, and that's how we strip graze. I would prefer to put an electric fence down there. So what happens is they only come into this area, they eat up this, and then that field has a chance to grow. Dad's opinion is that we don't do that because then they can always go back to a bit of grass, but then the cows will always take the best bit. They won't like try and do the best on that bit of ground, if that makes sense. So they'll always go for the good bit and then the bit that's just not as good, they'll leave and then that bit will never get better. You better get them to smash one bit of area whilst another bit of area recovers and then they can come back to that area that has recovered and then the bit that they smashed can have a break. So it works like that. Uh, so that's what I would personally rather do. We might end up doing that in a couple of days. Talking to daddy might change his mind. There's enough grass here for 
he was saying two or three days. I reckon we go more. Loads of grass here. He says going in the only spot that is no grass. Uh, let's walk through here. So there's loads of grass. You just seen me walk through it before. There is plenty. Cows are loving it. Don't you love that sound? All the cows crunching on it and munching on that fresh, um, fresh leaf. It's that, that's what I like. So I, that's, I like cows being happy, and obviously they're all enjoying it because all of them are stood at head down, except from that one who is sat down eating at the same time. That's what we call economy. That is that is a clever cow. Sit down and eat at the same time, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. You can also get your TP merch now, which is amazing at PemdasFarmShop.co.uk slash TP merch. You can pick that up through PayPal as well because I fixed that and I fixed the other thing that I'd an issue with as well, which. It's amazing. We are rocking and rolling. Carry on with a couple of jobs to do. But isn't this a great sight? Cows munching down. Very excited for it because I'm a mad loser. Guys, thank you very much. And we will see you in the next one. See you in a bit. Also, just at the end, so this is the new mic on top of the GoPro, not the new camera. What do you guys think? How was the quality? Was the quality good? Was the quality bad? Let me know. What kind of forfeit should dad do? If it doesn't last the whole season, what kind of forfeit? What kind of forfeit? I do. Quite interesting to get your comments. He'll definitely read these comments 100%. Let me know those couple of things on the mic because it's quite important for me because I'm trying to get improve the quality of my videos. And I understand that the mic before was awful. The wind isn't as bad today but it would just be nice to know. Guys, thank you very much for watching again. We'll see you in a bit. See you later.